Good Saturday morning, my friends. My bags and stuff were in the front seat today because I got a weasel in the back seat. Weasel, say hello. Say hello. He's shy. He's uh, coming with me today. Uh, we're doing some Saturday trucking. We're going down to Thief River Falls, Minnesota. I gotta pick up another uh, load of snow machines. Winter is on the way and people need their toys. It's amazing how many of these things uh, uh, get made every year. But uh, there's a lot of people out there. And a lot of people like to have fun, so we can't blame them. Gives me something to do on a Saturday. Uh, that's not being sarcastic either. I'm glad to be going trucking. I'll, I'll take it. I'll take all the hours I can get. And uh, we're really busy. Did I mention that in yesterday's video? Did you watch yesterday's video? We're really busy looking for drivers. Contact me. Let me know. Or contact Keystone Western if you are looking. Uh, you have to be a Canadian citizen. I uh, have two, two years experience, CDL, and the legal ability to work here. That all has to be in place prior to applying, okay? So if you're in a foreign country, uh, before you can apply, you first have to get your immigration and work visa set up first. And then your two years CDL experience. And then you can give us a call. We'd love to talk to you. But if you're an owner-operator, we are always, always looking for drivers. We've got lots of work, lots of work. So with that all being said, I'll see you at the truck. Must be the weekend. Lots of trucks in. Every weekend it fills up in here. Trucks, trucks, trucks. I like that one. Ooh, that's nice. Then come Monday morning, most of these trucks will be rolling out, headed to wherever they need to go. trailers just everywhere it's full sometimes it gets so full here on the weekends that it's uh, hard to find a place to park I've said that before I think I mean that's good it's good to see that uh, drivers are a lot of the drivers are at home with their families they really do value uh, family here this uh, company is based around uh, a family atmosphere I, mean, I don't want to speak too much on behalf of them, but from what I've experienced here over the last 10 years, I can speak to my experience, and I can tell you that they put a high priority on uh, family life. I really like that. Like, even just with my personal family, me, Britt, Weasel, our dogs, and uh, our fertility journey, trying to have our first child, and uh, you know, they completely understand that, and they back us 100% in that, and... Family is important, and they understand that. Keeping in mind, we still have to get the job done. We still have to get our work done. But uh, there needs to be a good work-family balance. Work time, family time balance. And uh, I think they do their best here, and they try really hard to make sure that that balance is correct. That's been my experience, anyway. So, Weasel, you ready to go trucking or what? You want to go in the truck? Diesel, come here. Come here. Say hi. Look, they're sitting right here. They're right here. Where? They're right here. Look. I don't see them. Where are they? Are they okay? Oh, yeah. Hi, guys. Going trucking. Trucking Weasel. This is the afternoon coffee. I already finished my morning coffee and I had my breakfast coffee. So I'm set, I'm good. By the time I get home, maybe I'll have an evening coffee. I don't know, tomorrow's Sunday. Don't gotta work tomorrow. Maybe I'll get wild and have an evening coffee. <laughs> Probably not, probably not though. I don't like coffee in the evenings. I don't even really like it in the afternoons. I usually have this, uh, my second coffee. I usually have it like late morning. But that's when I start really, really early before the sun comes up. Like, you know where the sun is usually at when we get to work, right? The sun is just below the horizon over there. Now it's already way over there. See how it's traveling through the sky? It's already staying in the southern hemisphere of the sky and uh, rising just south of straight east. So we're uh, past the equinox and we're headed towards the winter solstice. 
the sun starts rising further and further that way. And then it goes that way. You guys know me. I'm fascinated by that. So fascinated by the tilt of the earth and the way it spins and the way we're just flying through space on this space rock. That's cool. That's cool. Come on, weasel. Come on, you're careful for these rocks. They hurt your feet sometimes. Careful. Just take it easy. Don't run. These rocks are kind of sharp. I'm to get you little booties or something, man. Weasel booties. <laughs> or not. He's a tough guy. He can handle it. And it doesn't need little booties. He's a man. All right, Weasel. Yes, I am a man. I'm a big tough Weasel. Lord of all the Weasels and the Woozles. All right, we got the Weasel bed in operation. Right here, very high-tech patented design. Designed and master crafted by yours truly. With my expertise in carpentry. Fit for a weasel. Lord of the weasels. And your woozles, man. Don't forget the woozles. They're important. Yes. Them too. Okay. To your throne, my man. Go on. The stairs are a little rickety, man. Sheesh. Sheesh, I do something about that. A little rickety, man. All right, you ready to go trucking? Sorry, I should have helped them a little better for you. Okay, let's do it, man. If you ever find me on the road, see me driving, and you see the Lord Weasel steps strapped to my headache rack, you know that the Lord Weasel himself is with me. If you don't see that, he's not with me. He's not with me every day. He's got to do his lordship duties also. So he's a very busy guy. Right, man? Gotta keep the whole kingdom in order for me. You're my right hand man. Sit at the right hand of the king, right? Another successful day of trucking for the Lord of the Weasels. And the Woozles, man. Don't forget the Woozles. You always forget them. <laughs>